If you're coming from an institution and you have a license to use, follow your institution's instructions. They'll likely have already figured out the best way to get you access to MATLAB. The other option is if you're obtaining a personal license, in which case you'll need to purchase and download MATLAB. You can also take advantage of MATLAB's free trial online. Go to MathWorks or MATLAB.com and follow the instructions there. I'll show you my personal way of downloading MATLAB. I'm in my MathWorks account and I'm going to download the MATLAB installer. From here, it will open a new tab. In this tab, you can select what version of MATLAB you want to download. I'll be using R2020B throughout this entire series. Now, select your operating system. I'm using Windows, and thus a .exe file is downloaded. Once that's complete, click the file that's been downloaded to run it. This will then start the downloader. This may take a while on your system. After that is complete, you should see the MATLAB logo pop up and another MathWorks product installer appear. Here, you'll log in to your MathWorks account and you'll select some final properties that you'll use during the install. Select what toolboxes you want. These are the extensions of MATLAB if you want to install them. I only want the base package of MATLAB, so I'm unchecking the Simulink box for now. You can always install more toolboxes later. This installation will take a long time. Once your download has completed, search for MATLAB in your search bar or grab the desktop shortcut to open the program. After MATLAB has finished downloading, head to the start bar or the equivalent for your operating system and type MATLAB and select the icon to open the program. MATLAB will open and this will be your base screen set to all the defaults. We'll continue learning from here. See you in the next video.